Okay, I'm going to do a quick video here on how to install BitTorrent Sync when somebody else has sent you a secret. And I'm going to go down here to Safari. Open that up. I'm going to go ahead and just click on this here. Go to full screen here in the upper right hand corner. The double arrows there. And I'm going to just type bit sync. And the first thing that comes up is bittorrent.com slash sync. This is the right page. I'm going to go ahead and click on that. And it just opens right up. Do you want to get BitTorrent Sync Beta? And that's exactly what I want to do. And then it's going to go ahead and automatically download it for me. Boom, I have a quick connection. I'm done. I can click this magnifying glass here, the Show and Finder. Or I could just double click this and it starts opening up BitTorrent Sync. Now this is going to open up uh, an image file here if you can see this uh, disk image is opened automatically and I'm going to go ahead and take this and I'm going to drag it into the applications folder there I held it a little too long in the applications folder actually opened but you can drag and drop now if I want to run it I could double click that um, if if you just dragged and dropped it and let it go real quick uh, and it still looks like this you can always double click the applications folder uh, you can go down here and click on applications and get to it go ahead and open it it's gonna ask about a security issue here it was downloaded from the internet go ahead and hit open yes you know where you got it you can if I have sent you a secret you can click here and here and you can just copy and paste so you can go edit oh I don't have my my paste option isn't there, but Command V. I actually had a secret already saved that I had Command C copied out of a out of a file. So uh, so then you just click Next here. It's going to ask you where you want to put it, and I do not like this location. So I would say choose, and it's going to open up my root directory Jose here for my name. And then I'm going to go to, I'm going to double click documents here. And then inside of documents, you'll see that I've already created a folder called BT Sync. But I would, you know, you're going to have to hit new folder down here and type BT Sync. And it's already taken, it knows it's there because I already did it. But normally you just hit create here uh, and it's going to make this folder. I'm going to, then you select it. And now it's uh, my inside my documents inside BT Sync. This is going to make it a little easier to find in the future. If it's in your root directory, it can be a challenge uh, for newbies to to find. Then just click next, and there's a little tour here about how you can share with everyone and all your devices and everything. As long as everybody has the same secret, they're going to see what is in that folder, and it's going to sync automatically. And this is, uh, shows you the interface for the actual program. Click Next. How to copy a secret and send it to somebody else. Go ahead and finish. And then here's the program. Now if you see up here, this is if you need to find the program, it actually runs up here. And if you click this, this is what you would get right here. Now if you created your own folder and you shared your own folder there, back there instead of um, you know what I did where I put in a secret and it will generate a secret for you you can right click it or two finger click here and copy that secret and you can then send that secret to anyone you want and remember any files that you put inside of this documents slash BT sync folder are going to be shared with anyone who has that secret alright well thanks for watching